Hey everybody, this is Crazy with Crazy Gaming, and today we're taking a break from our regular series, and we are back in PAL world, but this time today we're going to work about finding a better place as a starting base instead of where we did start. And so we're going to quickly try to get through the tutorial. I'm going to run back down this way as I did in that first series because if you come back down this way, once you spawn, you will have an opportunity to gather some stuff that you can't get without going this way. There is a item right over here. It's part of the journal series in the game. And this is the first one. Day one dash one journal so we got that we wanted to make sure we got that i don't know if we can i'm going to go ahead and go down here real quick i don't know whether we can or cannot gather stuff down here whether the stuff is going to be there or not Fairly sure there's a chest right there. So we'll go get that chest real quick. We got some gold coins and a pal spear. And I think there was some more stuff over here. I don't know if we can go back here or not. Yeah, we can. I don't see anything over there. Making sure we didn't miss anything here. Okay, so we got that. Let's grab that stone. I don't know if we can collect any of this stuff. Nope. We can collect wood by punching trees. And we leveled up to level 2. So let's see if we can build anything yet. Okay, it's offering us to build this. And build a club. Now we'll at least be able to defend ourselves. Alright, so I'm going to hit B. Go to C. And we're going to go ahead and pick all that back up. So we're not wasting it. I'm hearing one of those cat things from somewhere. Oh, there they are down there. Come back here, Cativa. We have a pal. Now we have two pals. So now we have protection. A 
There's some items down here. We'll grab them real quick. Anything else over here? There's the chickens, chickpeas. There's another chest. So we got arrows times 17, but we can't build a bow yet. We are level 4 now, so we're getting up there. Let's see something here real quick, technology-wise. All that stuff's unlocked. We can unlock this. Pal spears. Campfire. Repair bench. Wooden structure set. I also unlock the wooden chest. And the old bow. Arrows as well. Shoddy bed. Straw pal bed. Off. Get one of those, and let's see if we can get a spear. We can't unlock cloth outfit yet. Okay, so you can level up fairly quickly, as you can see, just by coming down this back way instead of going out the normal way out front. And this is more of a gathering expedition than anything. Let's see, can we make... Nope, not yet. We will need to build this another table. There's some sheep. this guy all right so we got one of those we need, we're gonna end up needing like five of those so let's click this ball over here See if we can get this other sheep. And we leveled up to level five. Let some more stuff come over here. out of the ball so it's no sense in attacking those guys there's another ball right there and there's an effigy we want to grab that that's pretty much going to make us be done down here That's going to give us three of the five sheep we're going to end up being told to get. Ah, bottles and junk. We don't have any balls again. No, we don't. We only have one of those. Just for... Gets and giggles, let's build us another bench so we can start making some things to help us on our quest. Alright, so we need a pickaxe. Start production. Make some cloth. These are all giving us XP points that's going to help us level. 
unlocked more stuff. And this is, just shows you how fast you can level up pretty quick in this game. Alright, let's go into our tab and let's unlock that item that we were trying to unlock that we hadn't. The cloth outfit. Feed box. Alarm bell. Berry plantation. That's going to end that. Let's make our cloth uniform so we can get out of these rags and look a little more presentable. Anyway, so now we have these new duds. Let's switch to our pick and let's gather some of this stuff so we can make some more spears. Now, one of the benefits from coming down here first before going out the other way is the fact I have unused stat points. Let's do that real quick. We're going to st start by weight. I'm going to do that twice. And we want to do Stanima. Next, we'll be working on work speed. Right. Now this is a dungeon right here. We're way too low to go in there yet. I think we can make some more spheres, but before we do that, let's go over here and mine this. This last little bit. Head over to the bench, make us some spheres real quick. Let's do this first. It wants us to go to the options guide and then go to, to this survival guide. Yes. Okay, so we've got that. Now it wants us to craft the spear. And so we're going to do that. We're going to do max and we're going to craft. Need to get one of these here, but we need more wood and stuff, so. Let's see, what are we looking at here? I think we're pretty much down down here. So, let's go ahead and hit B, then C, and destruct. And we're going to go ahead and head out. I'm going to head back up top. Now you can climb. Oh. 
You can only climb as far as your stamina will let you, before it'll drop you. So we'll not run and we'll let our stamina build back up. Okay, so that's a nice little area that you can go down and level up five or six levels there, just so you know. And that's before you really enter into the the map or the large world. <clears throat> and it's an easy, easy place to get those first five or six levels so that you can do it without hindrance or dealing with enemies or any of that stuff. Okay. So when you come into the world, as most of you know that have been following the series, for those who haven't, first thing you're going to notice is this thing. This is a fast travel point. You want to go up to it, hit F to unlock it. Now you'll always be able to fast travel to this point if you need. There is a woman over here that we're going to go talk to. And she's going to give us some items. Been a while since someone did, didn't stink of pals worst up here. This island is a living hell. People came and aren't with us any longer. Those damn pals ate every one of them. Be careful out there. Now she's going to give us something. Here, take some basic supplies. You need to toughen up if you want to survive out here. There. And she gives us 10 wood. Okay, so I want to head towards the area where I want to do my first build. We'll gather some things along the way. And we will wait to build our first PAL box until we get over there. But we will, like I said, be gathering some stuff, including berries, which we can use for food. We can actually cook these berries. There's another sphere. Looking to collect five of these. I believe we have, th we have three right now. And this is just getting ahead of the game. These guys are, as you can see, 100%. That's going to level us up again. And this will be our fifth one. Oops. Is he dead? Yes, he is. Well, that was stupid. Got carried away. How many balls do we have left? We don't have any. We can make another one, though. I think. So... Let's go ahead and build our table again real quick. So we can make some more balls. <sighs> Jesus. Too many Christmas. Alright, so let's make some more of these. You're going to want to build up a nice stockpile of these. Alright, so we have that now again. Only we don't have any lambs around here. Let's go back and gather some more of these berries that we missed. So our hunger level is dropping, so what we're going to do is right click on these and we're going to eat. There's our final sheep right there. Let's go get him. There we go. put her in hustle and head over to the place that we want to build at. There's another pal sphere. 
I'm not picking up the chickens because they don't really provide much. They're totally cowards. They won't fight. They do. The only thing they really do is move stuff from one place to another on your base, which isn't motivation enough for me to continue with them or to try to grab one as a pal because it just takes up space. Have us some more berries. That guy's dangerous. You want to stay away from him. He won't bother you unless you aggro him. But if you aggro him, he will kill you. They have a 4200, I think, uh... HP, which makes them difficult to kill even at a higher level. What you looking for in a base? We have an egg, look at that. Another refugee, and then we have some stuff on this tree here that we want to get. Is that it? Yep. I guess that's it. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Those guys are too high level for us. We can probably get one of these Tifon elephants. We got one of those. And we like to have them because he has a water ability that will water the berry plantations when we build those to grow berries, which will give us a nice steady supply of berries. There's a dire howl. He's a level 10. We don't want to mess with that guy. This guy is good here. The squirrel. We want to get him. He's going to run us right back to the dire wolves, which will get us killed. I don't know why I can't catch this guy. He's going to drop. Nope, oh, we're going to get him. Sweet. Okay, we needed him. Let's get out of here. Where the dire wolves get us. That was a bad idea. We're only a level six, I think. We don't want the wrath of those guys on us. So we'll run away. Grab this chest. Okay, so the place we want to get to is over there. That one there that's wandering you saw across the bridge here, that's a, a boss. We don't want to mess with him either because he'll kill us. Now he doesn't aggro easy, or at least he wasn't, so I'm not positive, but I'm pretty sure 
He won't bother us unless we bother him. So this is the place I want to build the base because it has all this iron ore nodes here. Plus, it's really going to provide us some security against the raids because the raiders that come here try to climb up from the bottom down here and they can't. Alright, so let's get to building some stuff. I'm going to need this to start this, and I want to put this back over here. And we leveled up to level 7. Nice. Alright, so... Make the axe. What are we missing for the bow? We need a lot more wood and fiber. And we will get that cutting down these trees. Weight's getting up to the upper end of our max limit, but we're going to fix that in a minute. Alright, so now we have some materials. Let's open up this. Let's go to technology, and let's. we have the wood structures set up. Let's go over to foundations, and let's build us a couple foundations here. Oops. It's not what we wanted. Oop, did it again. Okay, so we have a nice little start here. This is really all we need for now. Put up some walls. I put windows pretty much all the way around so I can see out, but it doesn't really matter. You do whatever you like. You can build in front of the windows or place items in front of the windows. That's what you want to do. We'll leave this here for like this for right now. We'll put another one up here. And another one right there. And then now we need some roofs. Okay, now let's build bed, 
That way we can sleep, make the night go by fast. Alright, so we have some unused stat points, so let's go ahead and use those now. We'll use one up for this and one for the weight. Alright, now it wants us to build our owl box. And this is kind of tricky because you got to find the right spot for it to put it down. And there it is. We want it close enough to our base back in the back to cover it. So we'll put it over here, like this. Now it wants us to summon, summon someone to the base. We're going to summon this guy. He does a variety of things. And he will help us. We need to build him a bed. So to do that, we need to chop down some trees. Pick this back up. Let's go B, C, boom. And then we'll come back over here and we'll set this down after we put some stairs down. In fact, we'll put a couple of stairs down. Alright, we need a storage box next, but before we do that, I want to build a platform out here. And the reason I'm building a platform out here is so that we have a place, a medium place right in the middle to uh, We want a place out here that we can build things. Let's go unlock them if we can. Okay, we've got all this stuff. Fire arrow, fire bow, we don't need any of that. We want a normal parachute, that's going to help us. We don't need that. Gonna need a PAL workbench. Where is. The, we need a furnace. Where is the furnace at? There's the storage. There's the furnace. We gotta get to level 10 before we can build the furnace. Then we can start doing those things. But until we get to that, let's go ahead and unlock. I want to unlock these, but I really don't. We need the effigy. Do the logging site, the stone pit. I'll go ahead and unlock this.
unlock the mounted torch. That's going to do it for us. All right, so what we need to do is build a box. So that we have a place to store this these items, and I'm going to put it right here, I guess, maybe. This is going to let me. Let's put it right here in the corner. I can get it lined up. Eh, it's crooked, but I don't care. Just to store things in when we get full, and it'll have a place for him to put stuff when he starts gathering. All right, so I want to put. Down a bed for him and for now we're just going to set the bed over here or actually let's don't do that I have to build it and take it down so I want it on a, on a foundation I don't want it to just be sitting on the rocks Okay, so we're going to want to expand these foundations. I think we're going to be able to build one here. Yep, we can, I guess. But not there, no. Ah, uh, this is all going crazy. That looks right. That's not. That's right. Alright, so we're building these, this platform so that we can I know, I know Trying to make it easy for them to get up here. All right. So now we'll build the beds. We're going to build a few beds. Insufficient materials. We need more wood. But at least we'll have this one built. For our little squirrel friend. Get some more wood. And to do that, I think we'll go over here. We also want to get us a bow built. Now we're getting up on the limit of our inventory. Oh, 
want to be careful not to go over that because it will really hinder you. All right, so we need more beds. What is that noise? Oh, it's chopping wood. Look at that. We've built four. Okay, move off. Move, move, move. Ah, oh, crap. All right. So we're going to need to help him so I can get him out of the way so I can finish building these. Now he'll move out of the way, and we can go back to finish this last bed. Okay, so now we have eight beds, which means we sh might be able to level up here. Okay, so we're upgrading it now to two, and we just need to b build a primitive workbench, which we... I thought we did that. Oh, we haven't rebuilt it? Alright, so let's rebuild that primitive workbench. I'm going to put it over here. Because we want all the animals to be able to access it. Build our permanent workbench right here. Let's change that. There we go. Make us a shield that'll help protect us in battle. And we can also upgrade and have two more pals here.
We also want to make some more arrows. Mission wood and fiber, and we'll go get that in a second. that we have now in our inventory at 23. That's not bad. Let's go down and collect that wood that he's been chopping. Did he move all that up here already? Nope, he didn't. It's right there. And all you have to do is run through it. It automatically picks it up. And as you can see, here's our border for our base. Security. It looks like the sun's going down. All right, let's go ahead and upgrade our pal, pal box. Let's see. Build a feed box. We'll put that over here. Actually, let's put it over here. This is, this is where they'll be all spending most of their time when they're mining and whatnot. Let's go. Because they have to eat. Let's also build a fire. We can cook and we'll build it right next to it. Say right there. You have to be careful about building stuff too close together because then it'll be hard to. It will end up being hard to. Uh, let's do the meat first. Max, cook. Get our trusty frying pan out. Make us some grub. Lamb kebabs. Then let's go ahead and choose the mushrooms, max. And then the berries. Now the berries are great because you can actually um, you can actually make this as a general food for all the pals you have because all of them will eat it. Some of them like meat, some of them don't. So, As we can upgrade our pal box again. Next, we're going to run and grab some critters that we're going to be needing to get the kick off this place and get it going. Plus, we're going to need some people to help defend this place. Come back to this cooking later. Let's put some food in here for the pets. Let's upgrade our bench. Let's add this guy and let's add one of the sheep for now. Which one is he? Fragrant foliage. Nope. Brave. Let's get this guy. Okay. What about this guy? guy does mining so we'll swap out the sheep for him because the sheep really although they're helpful they're not just not that helpful okay so we've leveled up to four we only have two more levels or three more levels and we'll hit the base requirements I 
Howard conceded, don't want that guy. Ocious. Let's get that guy. Put him in there for now. All right. So, now that we have... Oh, we have not built our parachute yet, and we need to build that. Let's open this up and see what it's going to take. We need some more wood. He's cutting wood. They're gathering the wood and taking it over to the place over here. I'm putting it in the box. Let's grab that and that. All right, let's see. Let's put this stuff in the box, by the way. We don't need to carry this around with us. We also don't need to carry the, that around with us. Okay, so what I wanted to do was build that pole. We still need more stone, more fiber, and more wood. Now we can build this. With this, we can glide to a landing instead of just dropping off. Now what I'm looking for is one of the Firefox guys. There he is right there. What? Catching these guys is not easy. I should have had a bow first. I'm going to try to catch him. But we've gotten too close to these guys. Those guys will kill us. Let's get some stone. We need to get that bow crafted. inventory full? No. See if we can make it some bow real quick. And that's the cool thing about this, you can build these little benches anywhere. Yep, there we go. Grab as many arrows as we can. Hopefully that's going to be enough. All 
All right, let's get our, our bow equipped. Let's go see if we can get that little fire guy. I swore I saw him walk this way. Where the heck did he go? I see one back over by those dudes. Oh, there's a mount that we're going to want to get, but he's too high for us right now. Oh, shoot. He's almost done. Let's see. We have three. Real nice if we can get this guy. We got him. Now we just need to level up till we can make a saddle to ride him. Then we'll be able to fly places that we want to go. We'll let this guy out. We'll get this pal by releasing him. That's another fire animal, so that's going to help us. We want two of them if we can get them. I saw another one over here, but I think he bolted. Yep, there he goes. Yeah. That was our last one. I hope it works. Nice. So we got two of those now. There is another fast travel. Let's go down there and unlock it. This is a syndicate tower. We'll be coming back here because it's going to require us to after a while what level are we going to need to get to to get our mount saddle there's the harness for the fox it's down quite a ways I think there's the submachine gun that's what we need to get so we need to get to level 15 so we can get that riding mount done See if we can't come collect one of these dudes. Oh, what's going on here? Now, sometimes these guys fight and they do heck of damage to each other. Oh, I guess they're not fighting anymore. Oh, yeah, they are. And if they get low enough health, you, you're able to grab them. Let me get this monkey. Yeah.
if, if they get low enough, you're able to sometimes, uh, this monkey's still fighting me. I don't know what he drops when you kill him. Look at these guys going. We need to make us quickly make us some more. these if we can make these because if he gets down low enough health I can throw a ball on him and capture him but when you're gonna need a lot of balls to do it they're almost there come on baby three more Kicked it back. Yeah. Oh, I guess you can't do these guys with that one. So he's going to kill me if I don't get out of here. I think I de he's de aggroed now. I don't know why I can't, uh... What's this guy's health like now? Is he dead too? Yeah. What? Oh. Let me get him. Let me have him. I guess you can't do it while he's doing his thing while he's while you're in a fight. can't get him to get him in the thing again. The guy's trying to kill me. I know that. He's de aggroed, I think. Nope, he's still chasing me. I almost had him. Oh, he's still pissed. still chasing me. And I jump out of here. Not let yeah. Oh, we died. Well, we lost that chance. 
So let's respawn at our base. But we do have some new pals. And I think we can also... Oh, what do we need? Berry plantation. Can we build a berry plantation yet? Let's see. We have the stuff. Nope, we need six more stone. I don't think there's any stone piles here, if I remember. No. Armor is damaged. We need to do a repair bench. So let's rush this up here. We'll build this up here. We need eight stone for that as well. Is there stone down here somewhere? Can't remember. I think we go across. We go across the bridge. We'll get some stone. Almost nighttime, I think. Yeah, sun's going down. Let's grab us some stone real quick, and we will get some rest. Yeah, this one here is a boss. What level is he? Eleven, I think. Yeah, he's a level 11. No, we're not prepared to do him yet. Get us some rock. Let's head back to the base and we can get some sleep. We'll build that bench and prepare our armor. And then I think we'll call this a... Oh, we're too... We're too heavy. So we can no longer jump. And we walk very, very slowly. So, let's see what we could do about that. Just need to make it back over to our base. It's a long walk when you can only go this fast, but I'm not willing to drop anything. Make it daylight again real quick. Let's go over here and build a bench, repair bench. 
Let's actually put it back here. Or maybe let's put it over here. Not too close to the bed because we can accidentally hit the sleep button, which we don't want to do. Let's repair this. Let's repair this. Let's repair our pick. Repair our bow. And I don't care about the club. And in fact, well, I'm going to get rid of the club. Let's see. I do he's a woodcutter he's, he's a processor he does lumber pretty sure let's change him out with the sheep all right I have unused stat points Go use those. Let's do the weight again. Let's do one on the attack. Put the pal juice in there, the bullets we don't need. We don't need that, don't need the leather. Don't need to carry those. We need these for making the ingots and whatnot. How are they doing on food? They're doing pretty good. Cook some more berries real quick. Not what I wanted to do. Where's my pal bench at? We want to bring this guy down. Waterproof runner. Let's change him out with this guy for right now. So I'm going to grab him. Oh, he's going to do it on his own. Now he's going to see he'll finish cooking up the berries and stuff for me. Where are we at on technology? Pressure. Barrel, way better storage. Hot springs makes them happy. The furnace is what we want next, and that's going to be at level 10. And then we'll be able to make nails and all kinds of stuff. Like metal pickaxes and all that junk. Okay, so that's what I wanted to do for today's episode. I'm trying to keep it short. I wasn't able to get on last night and make another video. So I want to get this off, but this to me, if you look on my map, this spot here is really the best for building your first base because you have this ore here that's going to come in very handy and as you level up, it will become important. There's many things there's left to do here as we're just starting this one. But the next video will be back on our normal character, which I think is level 33 now or something like that. We're up pretty good. Anyways, we'll continue in that one in the next one. Appreciate you watching. Please leave a comment. Let me know what you think. 
hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't subscribed and hit the bell for notification when we drop our next video it's crazy with crazy gaming appreciate you thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next one bye for now